Oppenheimer release status in Japan remains unclear. Christopher Nolan's latest offering, Oppenheimer, has a direct but painful connection with Japan. So as the film has been rolled out in theatres globally, questions have been raised over its status in the Japanese cinematic market. The United States had launched two atomic bombs on Hiroshima and Nagasaki on 6 and 9 August 1945, respectively to force Japanese forces to surrender. The attack raised the cities to the ground, killing at least 110,000 people. But as far as release in the country is concerned, the World War II science epic was not officially banned, suggesting chances of release are not dim. But the release date of the film is not announced either. In June, the Universal spokesperson told Variety that plans have not been finalized in all markets. As a result, Japanese cinema goers will not be able to see Oppenheimer like the rest of the world. Historically, the American scientists' motives for the Japanese city's bombings were open to lively debate. The 67-year-old was part of the scientific committee that gave the nod to the War Department to use the atomic bomb against Japan as early as possible. But a caveat was presented by the bomb maker scientists, who argued that the bomb should be targeted at military targets only, or instead tested publicly to scare the Japanese into surrender. Subscribe to our channel for the latest on your favorite celebrities. Like, comment and share and don't forget to press the bell icon for notifications.